morning to our students in last class we discussed about the bernoulli's differential equation in this session the last topic is exact differential equation what is an exact differential equation how to identify it is a, an exact differential equation by observing if the given condition or an equation which is in the form of m dx plus n dy is equal to zero means here m and n are the terms which are in x and y both means we can write this is here as f of x comma y dx plus g of x comma y dy is equal to we can write uh, any one of the form of an exact differential equation means the terms are divided in terms of dx and dy where the m and n are functions in x and y both then how to identify and we can derive the exact differential equation by separating the m and n terms what is m and what is n from the given equation by finding do m by do y is equal to do n by do x then it is said to be a exact differential equation means by deriving the m and n values m m the function m derivative with y the result and the function n derivative with x the result both are same then it will be said to be a exact differential equation and its solution will be integral of m dx where y as a constant means we cannot derivate integrate the y variables plus integral of terms in n free from x means there is we are writing only y terms without x terms into dy is equal to constant or we can say this general solution in another way also m dx na so we can keep n dy here x is a constant plus terms of m free from y and integral dx is equal to c we can choose any one of the method here i am writing uh, this is the method so we can write an example dy by dx plus y cos x plus sin y plus y by sin x plus x cos y plus x is equal to 0 by doing cross multiplication it will become sin x plus x cos y plus x into dy plus y cos x plus sin y plus y into dx is equal to 0 equation one observe what is the form of the exact differential equation m dx plus n dy dx coefficient will be taken as a m dy coefficient will be taken as a n so means here m is equal to m dx m means y cos x plus sin y plus y and what is the value of n n dy dy coefficient n sin x plus x cos y plus x and uh, their derivatives with respect to the y and with respect to x then do m by do y means we are derivating m with respect to y means here x is uh, constant means cos x y derivative 1 we will keep cos x as same and plus sin y derivative cos y plus y derivative 1 the do m by do y value is cos x plus cos y plus 1 and similarly do n by do x value with respect to x i am derivating the n sin x derivative cos x plus with respect to x y will be constant x derivative 1 then it will be cos y and x derivative 1 cos x plus cos y plus 1 observe here do m by do y value cos x plus cos y plus 1 cos x plus cos y plus 1 so here we will observe do m by do y is equal to do n by do x so therefore 
the given equation is an exact differential equation exact differential equation then we'll go through the solution of a differential equation which is exact what is the solution of a differential equation integral m dx where y constant integral of n free from x means without x terms into dy is equal to 0 by 1 to 5. So then the solution will be solution of exact differential equation. Then m dx integral of m dx plus integral of terms in n free from x into dy is equal to c. Integral m dx, what is m value here which is y cos x plus sin y plus y. y cos x plus sin y plus y into dx plus integral of terms in n free from x. Free from x means without x terms in n. Observe sin x, x cos y, x. In each and every terms in n, we have a x variable and x function. So there is no term in the n without x. Means uh, we can keep 0. dy is equal to c. Then integrating the m value with, re with respect to dx means here y chosen as a constant means y integral of cos x value sin x plus integral of sin y here y is a constant there is no x term so we can keep sin y integral of dx value x plus here y also constant integral of dx value x plus integral of dy will be 0 that is equal to cos then the final solution is y sin x plus x sin y plus x y is equal to c is the general solution of the given exact differential equation thank you in next topic we will discuss about some more examples on differential equation